kings and queens, it's your girl Queen V's back with another video for you, you, and you. And today I'm so excited we have another mukbang for you guys. We have some keen crab legs, black bean noodles, and this yummy spicy lemon butter sauce. Cajun butter sauce y'all. I'm so excited. Make sure you guys check the description for the coldest water. Use promo code QUEEN for free shipping. All right guys, I'm gonna get started in eating and then we're gonna go into the creepy text message. Today, this text message is between Jennifer and Daniel. So, let's eat first and then get started. But before we get started, I'm gonna ask you guys to do me a huge favor. I'm gonna ask you to look at the subscribe button. If it is red, you are doing something wrong. Click the subscribe button, click the post notification next to the subscribe button to all. Yeah, to oh. Once you did that, let us know in the comment section that you did that and you might get shouted out in our next coming videos. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. All right, let's get started. Started, started. We got these huge king crab legs. Ooh, that crack, that crack was definitely everything. And the black bean noodles. This is the spicy black bean noodles, the green pack. So I'm gonna try it with these king crab legs to see if it's a pretty good combination. I think it is gonna be because last time when I had the black bean noodles and the prawns, I should probably make another video of that. It was really good. How your guys day been? Let me know. Was it good? Was it slow? Was it boring? Was it fast? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section how your day was. My day was extremely slow. I felt like today was like one of the most boringest days that I've ever did. It was super lazy. I was this close to not recording this video. I just wanted to lay down, y'all, and rest. Have you ever had those moments where you don't want to do anything, not one piece of thing, not one thing? You just want to lay down and rest? Yep, today was definitely a wanting to rest day, but I was like, you know what? I gotta post a video, so no. We gotta record. I'm gonna take my first bite, y'all. I'm just trying to make this a little much easier because once I get into the text messages I want it to be a little smoother so I'm gonna cut this one crab leg and then I'm gonna start eating <clears throat> I probably should do a de-shelled ready 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 mm, 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 mm. yeah yeah y'all all right, first bite. That was good. That, that was good. I gotta make sure I don't got sauce dripping down my chin like last, last video. That was hilarious, man. Should I put it together, y'all? Sure. I think I should. Mm -mm. Woo! Yes. Oh yes. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I'm liking it. Liking it, liking it. Oh, excuse me. Really liking this combo. Black bean noodles. I wonder what else black bean noodles would taste good with.
If you guys have any other crazy combos that black meat noodles taste good with, let me know in the comment section, please. Because this here... Mm-hmm. The sauce and the noodles and the crab legs just comes together great. I'm definitely gonna have more mukbangs like this for sure. Oh yeah. All right. Okay. Let me start with the text message. Today's crazy, crazy text message between Daniel and Jennifer. First text message. Hi, Jen. How are you? I'm so sorry about what happened to you and your family. Mrs. Carmichael told us about it this morning. Hmm. I'm sorry you couldn't make it back to school after that bear attack in South America. The whole school had a moment of silence for you guys. I can't believe I attended the first day of high school without you. Oh, so I guess Daniel could be like a really good friend of Jennifer right now and her and her family got in a bear attack. Two hours later, she didn't text back. You should have never gone to South America for the summer. Just reply th to this text message, please. Are you okay? She still didn't reply, so he texts Jen, question mark. And then five days later, damn, five days later, is she even alive though? If it's really five days later, what y'all think? What y'all think? Mm. He texts again. He's definitely not giving up. I wonder if she's dead. Five days later, he said, the carnival in the park is leaving. I wish we had spent time on their roller coaster on their last summer here. Okay, he's reminiscing. You were crazy about the roller coaster, right? I like roller coasters. I'm like really thriller. I like to have fun. One day later, he, she still didn't text. And then he texts, if you need anything, just text me back, okay? I can give you food, clothes, and anything. See, that's a real friend right there. My mom and dad have agreed to let you stay with us if you have nowhere else to go that's nice i don't know if i will let a girl sleep over you know might think something might go on so i don't know slow but if she don't have nowhere to live then maybe but she's not even responding still she's still not responding so apparently might be not even available Hopefully this text message is not literally just him just texting and reminiscing and she's already gone. Uh, since nobody is in your house now except your dog basically, I guess. I wish you were here. Five days later, when you woke up, I want you to know that the whole school cares about you. Okay, so I guess she's sleeping or either in like a coma type stuff. He says, we all love you, Jen. I think you are the nicest girl I ever met. The greatest person and the best friend I ever had. I brought you your favorite chocolate, Cadbury. Oh. So she's probably in a coma, y'all. Mrs. Carmichael took the whole class on a trip to the hospital to visit you this Friday. We brought gifts and cards. I hope the doctor allows you to eat them when you wake up. He didn't let us see you. Said you were in a coma. Okay, so she's in a coma. Just know this, we all miss you. Aw. So basically, after the bear attack, she got in a coma. And he, look at y'all, I got it. And he's, he's just texting her the whole time. That's a good friend. But this food is so yummy. Hmm. One week later, that means she stood in text, but now she says, she finally texts now, y'all. I'm fine, Danny. 
Look at the little cute Danny text message name. Ooh, Danny. Not Daniel, Danny. I would say, you know, y'all might as well, you know, make it official. I'm fine, Danny. I just saw your text messages this afternoon. You made me so many text messages. They added up to the text messages our classmates send. He texts, Jen, how are you? Are you okay? Are you feeling well? How are you feeling? I'm feeling a bit strange. Okay, now, this is probably when it gets a little weird. Who says that? I'm feeling strange. Okay, she says, what kind of strange? She said, I don't know. Thank you so much for the gifts anyways. You sent so many gifts. And a picture of the gifts. This looks like it's more just chocolate, basically. So, she's saying she feels strange. To me, that's a little weird. I think this is where the weird stuff happened. And... Uh -huh. All right. Now he said, after Mrs. Combo bought, hold on, let me relax. I'm being too greedy. After Mrs. Combo brought us to visit you, I have been visiting you on my own. Okay, that's nice. I brought you food every day and your favorite books. Aw. Still, they won't let me see you. I don't want you to see me like this. She says. Like what? I mean, like you're injured? She said, I have these irreversible black colors around my eyes. Mm -mm. That's just not right. That picture right there, mm -mm. that's not right. She like a zombie. That's that's not normal dark spots. <laughs> like I got dark spots when I'm tired or I didn't sleep. That's not normal dark spots. That's and she said irremovable. That's anemia. <clears throat> that's maximum anemia. That's what that is. Maximum anemia. She a zombie, y'all. Unless she was really, really losing blood. But again, she don't look normal. She do not look normal. I slept already, but I still look sleepless. I don't... I do not feel sleepless, just hungry. Okay, he said, don't you worry. I'm sure you're prettier with it. But he's nice, you know? Nice, nice, nice guy. He asked, have you eaten the Cadbury? She said, no, I haven't eaten any of them yet. And please keep yourself away from me. She put a question mark, why Jen? I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. Mm -hmm, you shouldn't. I just don't want you to see me like this, okay? Okay, I get it. Well, okay, but what's wrong with the chocolates? She said, nothing. I haven't eaten anything since I woke up. I just don't like all foods now. Okay. The nurse said it's just the trauma, which that could be true. But I think I want to eat something else, but I don't know what it is. If it's trauma, maybe you need more rest. I'll let you rest now, Jen. Make sure you get enough sleep. Good night. Mm hmm. I have had way too much sleep already, Danny. All I really want right now is some person with good flesh. Mm -mm. Yeah, she's a zombie. It's official. The apocalypse. That's what's going on right now. I think what's going on right now is she probably got rabies or something from the from the bear. Or some some crazy apocalyptic virus or something like that. She said, someone fat, 
I don't know. And then it shows a picture of this guy. Wow. Yeah. Just run. Run away. You don't sound well rested to me. Sleep. Okay. See, this is crazy. If somebody texts you guys this, right? And they tell you all this stuff. I would first be like, ha, you're playing, da 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 da, whatever. Now, if the person really convinced me and tell me they're serious, like, because she seems pretty serious through your text, and he's just bypassing and saying, well, yeah, you just go to sleep, yeah. Talk to you tomorrow, bye bye. Like, that's the, this, that's what I don't get sometimes. Some movies are just not realistic. Like, in real life, I would not be like, yeah, all right, talk to you later. Huh, just get some rest. You'll feel better. You'll stop saying that you want to eat people. He said, last thing he said, sleep. And then she said, I don't know what that bear had. Probably rabies. All right, she said, I don't know what that bear had. He said, what do you mean? And then she just texts some weird text messages. Not in your rate a literal more slip. I don't know. Yeah, that. Yeah, see you there. Good night. I assume that's what she texts. Good night. And then he texts, "What happened to your spelling? You all right? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just tired. It's okay. Good night." And then he says, "Yes, looks like. Yes, looks like it. Good night." Eight hours later. Good morning, Jen. How are you feeling now, Jen? 12 hours later, she stood in text. Hi, Jen. He stood in text. She stood in text. I just got home from the hospital. I tried to visit you. I thought I could finally see you, but is it true you got transferred to the, well, mental hospital? You sounded mental before. Hello. And then show this picture here. They had me restrained so I couldn't reply to your recent text messages, but the guys here think I'm well behaved, so they let me lie around without restraints and with my cell phone. I told you not to visit me. She probably wanted to eat you too, like. Why did you go? This is what I'm talking about. It's weird. It's just weird. Oh my god, what happened? What did you do? She said, nothing. I'm sorry. I just changed. What kind of change? Are you alright? I do not feel alright. I'm just watching this thing in the news. The hospital you came from is in the news. And then you have that. They say the doctors are attacking the patients. What is this? I'm switching to other channels. They have the same news. They say... The patients are attacking other patients now. Yep, they got rabies. They got rabies. This is crazy. What is happening? It's all my fault, she said. What? He said. They are all infected now. My doctor must have bitten the other doctors when they brought him to the operating room. Okay. Okay, the broadcasters are calling it a zombie attack. And what are you talking about? She is a zombie. She's probably supposed to be dead right now. Like, but somehow something happened where she came back to life. I really want to know. What really happened to her? Mm -mm. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. And he was about to visit her. When she sent that picture of the doctor. The voluptuous doctor. She she probably bit him then. She probably bit him then. Little nasty. Okay, she said, I'm sorry. I was just so hungry last night. I was wanting wanting a little meat. I bit my doctor. I just couldn't stop myself. 
in gibberish, I guess she's trying to say, I'm so sorry, Danny. How did he even still go and visit her? That don't make no sense. He still went ahead and visit her. That make no sense at all. And I really don't like when they end that way. I wish they just ended like a whole thing. Like, I want to know what happened. What type of virus was it? Did she die and come back alive and she's actually a zombie, like Walking Dead? Let me know if you guys watch Walking Dead. Have watched Walking Dead before. I used to, but I don't know. I feel like ever since, I don't know. I feel like the Negan part of the whole Walking Dead se season, that whole season, it just was, wasn't the same vibe anymore. I don't know. So guys, I'm going to end the video right here. Before I end the video, I'm going to do my post notification shout out right here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for subscribing, clicking the post notification, and being one of the first views to comment once I post a video. I really appreciate you and each and every one of you guys. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you guys subscribe, click the post notification next to the subscribe button, and give this video a big thumbs up. And I'm always going to leave you guys with I love you, you're perfect, you're beautiful. Peace. Mm -hmm.